welcome back, Dukes and Dukes. Welcome back to YouTube. It's Eddie at TV. I'm Eddie back with another reaction video. We are doing, <laughs> we are doing extreme cheapskates, okay? The one we got for today, hairdresser uses farm animal products on her clients, okay? Oh yeah, by the way, I got broken glasses, but new ones are to come. I just ordered them like last week. But yeah, man, before we hop straight into the video, you already know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. If you're new, subscribe. It's free. And yeah, let's get into this video, man. Extreme Cheapskates. I did a couple episodes before, and it, it, was, it was hilarious. It was funny. So I'm like, why not do another one? So here we are with another episode, and let's get it popping, man. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Can you give me like two seconds? All right, you can come on now, Will. I got you. Hey, Lynn went to school and she got her cosmetology license and she came to me and said, hey, Dad, I'm in school now, so can I start working for you doing hair? I agreed and one of the best decisions I made. Before Palin started working here, we used to just sweep it up and throw the hair away. But since she's been here, she's been collecting it. because it actually saves me money. I have long hair, short hair, straight hair, curly hair, kinky hair, it doesn't matter. I collect it because hair has a lot of uses. Why are you saving that? What are you doing I with the hair though? Uh, okay, are you putting the extra hair on your customers? Cuz that's that's da darn it. That's that's sick. But other than that, what could you be using hair for? Somebody tell me that in the comments. Or let's figure it out as she says what she uses it for. Fertilizer? Fertilizer? Have you ever heard of plant food? I'm not gonna spend money on plant food. It's not food for me. I use a lot. You can hair. you could actually use hair for fertilizer? What? Where does she read this at? <laughs> oh man. Hair for the couch cushions because with the stuff in it inside it just makes it more comfortable to sit on. See? Once you put the hair oh. in it, see this one. It makes the couch a lot softer. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh, you see his face? See this one. It makes the couch a lot softer. He's like, man, if if she don't stop trying to save money and and, and and bro, he wanna slap her. Like if if he could, he would smack the cheap out of her. This dude is just and he has a nice ball too. Softer. She showed me the couch. I'm like, what what the hell is that? <laughs> you know. There's not enough money in the world to have me save hair. The customers, they may think Payless really cheap, and she is, but she saves me and the shop a lot of money. <laughs> Look how he said, a lot of money. When it comes to He's happy about option, that. He don't care. The car that I have is perfectly fine, and it still runs, so I don't find the need to buy a new car. What is all those? an accident, so instead of going to the dealership paying like $200, I got my own grill. It's and not even straight. It didn't cost me anything, and I put it on with these hair ties. What the heck? It gets really hot here in Georgia. So instead of buying a steering wheel cover, I wrapped it in wig tape, and it keeps my hands cool. There's nothing you can't fix with hair ties and wig tape. Mm -hmm. Palin Mathis is hosting a bridal party. There's plenty of things you, you, you can't fix. But before she can host clients, Palin needs products. The Bro. most expensive thing about having bridal parties at the shop is they want expensive lotions, expensive creams. I actually figured out a way I could host these bridal parties without spending very much money at all. Please. Expensive shampoo is a total scam. I can go to the beauty supply store and get the shampoo that's on the bottom shelf because it, it gets the job done. Okay, your total is three fifteen. There it is. She gave the exact coin. Bro, man. Sometimes that could be annoying, man. I'm not even. Actually, use products that are really for animals. How's it going? Hi, how are you? Pretty good. How can we help you today? I'm a salon owner. 
and I'm throwing this big like bridal party. Uh -huh. I was thinking if you guys had a couple items you could sell me. For a, a bridal party? We sell feed, hay. And... We've had people coming by asking for roosters and hens and goats. Want to buy goats all the time, but never beauty supplies. <laughs> <laughs> Everything we got is for animals. Is it okay if I look in the shed? Yeah, go ahead. Sure. I could find some of the beauty supplies at the farm. I don't know. Beauty supplies might be okay at a farm. They made you beautiful. The Man and Tail shampoo. A lot of salons actually use that product. So Bro. I knew I hit a gold mine. And I found kitty litter. Clay kitty. kitty litter has the exact same ingredients that you would find in a $200 clay face mask. What in the world could you use kitty litter for? It'll work perfect for like a face mask. Never heard of such. See? Hold up, bro. Now, whether it works or not, I don't know. But we, she could be actually doing something real, real smart. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yes, yeah, it might be cheaper. But if it actually does work, are we getting played at the stores? Oh, she's going to do that. going to make mud out of it or something, put it on people's faces. <laughs> You're going to make mud out of it instead of selling it on people's faces. Yeah, two big jugs of petroleum jelly for cow's udders to keep them tender for when the calves are sucking on them. What? I have about for cab, cab udders? <laughs> Yo, son. You can use it for your lip balm, salt scrub, foot scrub. You can use it for just about anything. That's a lot of petroleum jelly. Yeah. She's gonna use more people's lips. That's cheap. Let's see. It'll be 5, 11, 12, 13, 14. Uh, heck, I don't know. How about 10.50? 10.50? That's a little pricey, but okay. What? That's a lot of product for ten fifty. To the beauty supply store, I probably would spend well over a hundred dollars. So yeah, it worked out perfectly. You talking about somebody? Weird one. She got two jugs of petrol. I can't even say that word. She has two jugs of petroleum jelly. What the heck, bro? I need some help. Nah, you good. You good. This is gonna be my chocolate fantasy. But scrub. The chocolate fantasy. She actually put chocolate chocolates in there? Chips, salt, and petroleum jelly. Then I stick it in the microwave. And oh, it and man. It. So you're gonna put chocolate chips on people? Yep. Oh, uh, what is this for? <laughs> he said, hold up, wait. This dude said, so you're going to put chocolate chips on people. He said, I'm more sad for the chocolate chips than for the people. <laughs> hold up. Then I stick it in the microwave and melt it and I mix it up. So you're going to put chocolate chips on people? Yep. Now, what is this for? It's a special clay mask. Go ahead, mix oh that. Oh, my God. Mix that in. Really? Uh, that's just nasty. It just looked real bad. Hi, Kaylee. Oh. We have some cakes for you and some finger Bro, I wouldn't. Instead of spending $75 to $100 on finger sandwiches, I actually made some waffle and sausage sandwiches. Oh. And I had some Twinkies and I put strawberry jelly on top for the dessert. Let's get these puppies off. Then. Bro. Okay, we're gonna get your hands looking great. It's a freaking flying this is here. A scrub. This is our famous chocolate fantasy. It's organic. When I was rubbing it in that chocolate fantasy, after a while, it really smelled good to me. Because <laughs> it got chocolate in it. Oh, that looks so nasty. It's a ah. clay mask. Very exfoliating. Ugh. I'm really glad I came to Payla and Rob's shop. No, you're not. This has been a really great way for me to start off my wedding. I'm always gonna be a saver. I think nothing, nothing's probably ever gonna change. To my surprise, she really pulled it off. We made a great profit. To have more money in my pocket just makes me feel good. Bro, the way this dude, the, the way her dad or whoever that is, talks about like saving money. He he's really excited about it. You can see it on his face like he's really excited that he's he's saving money. He's not doing the dirty work. He's just collecting bills. So so that's kind of funny. But I feel sad for the ladies that went to the bridal shower, man. I mean, 
I don't know. The products could be good. They could work. I don't know. I, I'm being honest. I don't know anything about it. And about, about the ingredients in shampoo or face mask. But it looked nasty to me. That's that, that's all I'm saying. It looked nasty. It might it might have turned out great. I don't know. But uh, let me know what you guys thought about this video down in the comments below. <clears throat> Make sure you like this video and subscribe. And also check out the uh, other pages that I have down in the description below. The, the, the gaming channel, the vlogging channel, and also any video that gets blocked on the main channel will be reposted on the Facebook page. So go to the Facebook page and uh, check that out as well. Edia TV at, at well, Edia TV on Facebook. Um, but yeah, till the next episode, it's Edia TV. Bye.